What up, everybody? It is that time again. We're going to be doing 2017 Illusions Football. Inner case break number 19, eBay style. There it is on the screen. You did try, Jeremy. I mean, I mean, you, you, could, you could do a little better than that. You could do a little bit better than that. By the way, I got I got the payment uh, chase. We got Ravens and Bills also gone. And limited, limited down to eighteen teams now in the store. So let's get that underway, peeps. Uh, it's it's you know my thing with the discounts is it's got to be at least two or three teams. You get two or three teams, I'll be willing to give you a little deal. Uh, but now, let's get this illusions underway. I've made y'all wait long enough. Uh, I do have another one scheduled at 9. It's high-tech baseball. We'll do that right after this. All right? So here's we go. Well, listen, Rockets boy, the, that's, that's, how, that's how you got to defend, you know, some of the teams out here, uh, especially when you don't have the talent that the heat are really lacking is we have to defend everybody like you know what i'm saying we 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 contest every shot we close out all the you know on every on everyone and you know that's the only way we've been able to have the success we have had is because of our scrappiness and you know the way we play team ball um same thing with coach popovich man coach popovich is is a fucking Genius, he's maximizing everyone's potential. Uh, but if I'm being honest with you, Rockets boy, I'm I'm rooting for you guys. The way James Harden is playing MVP season, you know, it's it's not even close right now. Honestly, the MVP race, James Harden has it by a, by a mile right now. Uh, but we will see what it's what what is gonna be like in the playoffs because I think the what the yeah this is an inner case of illusions. Uh, with with um with what you call it with the with the uh the playoffs coming around you know it's it's going to it's not going to be that fast paced it's it's not going to be that fast paced so uh you know possessions are going to go down you're you're going to go deeper into the shot clock so we'll see yeah, illusions is inner case, Jeremy. I, I I got this, dog. I got this. That's what I'm saying, Rockets boy. Like you guys run the pick and roll to perfection, but that's kind. Of, it's kind of difficult to defend the pick and roll with James Harden or. Uh, Chris Paul, because those, those dudes are the masters at running the pick and roll. Jeremy, no worries, man. It's all good. I would just be careful the amount of work you guys are giving James Harden, man. Give give that guy some, some resting time, but not enough to where that it's, uh, you know, a detriment in the playoffs. But I definitely, I, I do like the Rockets, man, you know, but I, I got to be, I got to be realistic at the same time, man. You know, history tells us defense win championships and your all-star has to buy into it. Uh, so I don't know, man. We'll, we'll, we'll see. I am, I will be rooting for the Rockets on the West. Don't get me wrong. I'm tired of the, the Warriors dominance. So starting things off here is a card we got a random. Number four out of ten, we got Deshaun Watson and Deshaun Kaiser. I'm listen, Rockets boy. I'm definitely rooting for you guys out in the West. Definitely rooting for you guys in the West. Tired of the Warriors' dominance. I would like to see someone else step up. Sidney Jones of the Eagles to fifty. I will say this though, Chris Paul is a bit of a curse. Chris Paul is a bit of a curse. So be on the be on the lookout for that guy. I wouldn't put too much trust in him, honestly. 
crazy as this sounds, I would have Chris Paul as my third option. So this matching numbers card is going to have to get randomed. We'll do that at the end of the break. Josh Richardson is balling right now. LeBron to Warriors next season. I think uh, if that happens, I think they would shut that trade down. Deshaun Watson with a three-color RPA number to 50. That is nice. That is nice. Who else we got? Jordan Howard of the Bears patch. An autograph for Jack Doyle right there for the Colts. I like the Warriors too, don't get me wrong, but... I like to see different teams win. Uh, Grizzle B's high tech is going to be right after this. He is a free agent, but I I'm pretty sure the league still has to approve the trade. You know, you rem if, I don't know if you remember correctly, but there was a point where Chris Paul, I think Chris Paul and Carmelo Anthony were going to go to to Los Angeles and play with Kobe Bryant, but the league the league put a stop to that trade. Because it, you know, it was like a competitive kind of imbalance deal. I don't know. Right, David Stern was like, nah, we ain't doing that shit. So, dude, could you imagine if LeBron James goes to the Warriors? Well, that's true. It was, it was a trade. But that's probably the only way the Warriors are going to be able to sign him. Is through through some sort of uh, uh, sign and trade, from what from my knowledge, I don't know what the what the Warriors books are looking like, uh, but we'll see. It should be definitely interesting. You know, if I'm LeBron, honestly, at this point in his career, man, he shouldn't pick a third team. You know, it's really gonna ruin his legacy. He either should just stay in Cleveland and ride that wave to the end of his career. Or go back to Miami, man. I said it before, and I'm going to continue to say it. He should have never left Miami, man. He should have never left Miami. But, hey, you, what are you going to do? All right, here we go. So, another one to random. Corey Davis and Mike Williams. Titans Chargers duo patches. That has to get randomed. What else we got? Drew Brees. I hit a one of one of his earlier in Vertex Football. Guys, we got nine teams left in the inner case of Vertex Football on our website. Get into it and let's rip that thing. We got TJ Watt of the Steelers to 100. That is a nice card. It's a nice card. You know, I, I understand LeBron wanted a quick fix going to Cleveland. You know, it's actually, damn, Texans murking this thing. To 25, Dante Foreman, the autograph. RPA to, uh, style 2 for the Texans. LeBron really should have never left Miami. He would have been playing with the team we have right now. But, you know, I don't know. He should have, he should have trusted Pat Riley. I think D. Wade is going to is gonna sign for us. In, uh, he's going to sign with us in the offseason. season. And just retire with us. That that that's a move that I'm sure Pat Riley's still kicking him himself in the ass till the to this day. How the hell do you let your franchise player leave? Over like over like twenty million dollars? They could have put something together, bro. D Wade is not trash. Don't say that, bro. Come on. Let's be honest. D Wade is not trash. He may not be what he used to be. But he can still put up 25 and 5 on any given night. Right now, right now? I mean, consider the fact that he's playing for the Cleveland Cavaliers, dog. He doesn't have a coach. Tyron Lue is not a coach. They're, they're out there playing pickup basketball every night, man. Like, those dudes are not being coached. So you mean to tell me if D-Wade go, goes back to Miami, he's not going to put up numbers? 
in a, in a system he pretty much created with one of the best coaches in the league and Coach Spo. Come on, man. We'll get him right. Oh, dude, you must be salty, Rockets. <laughs> dude, D. Wade is a fucking animal, bro. Even in his advanced in the, in the advanced stages of his career. Oh, you mean the you mean the video guy, Coach Spo? Yeah, I mean that's he came up. That's how he came up. He was video coordinator for us. He he used to put the the, the highlights together. And now he's a coach. Pat Riley gave him the blessing, so, you know, if Pat Riley's out here giving blessings, Pat Riley, to me, is like the godfather of the NBA. You feel me? Like, if Pat Riley makes a move, it's it's going to send, you know, you know, the ripples are going to be felt throughout the entire NBA. In Pat we trust, damn it. And I, I really just want to see D-Wade in a heat uniform again, man. Davis Webb of the Giants with a napkin. He started at the, you know, started at the bottom. Now we here, Rockets boy. Kenny G of the Lions, number 12 out of 25, the RPA. Four colors on that patch. That's nice. The Heat getting their ass whipped right now by the Sixers. We are getting spizzanked. For the Eagles, Donnell Pumphrey to 150. For the Seahawks, Russell Wilson. I got a prediction. I got a prediction for next season. Not only are we going to pick up D. Wade, we're also going to pick up Paul George. Is our future uh, franchise superstar. And we're going to make a move that's going to bring Damian Lillard to the heat. Boom. Malik McDowell, the Seahawks, the 250. Because I'll be honest, man. Damian Lillard needs to get out of the West Coast. He needs to get out the West Coast. It's way too many guards out there. And that guy is way too great. To not be recognized year in and year out as a as a as an all star. And honestly, man, Blazers they're really going nowhere, man. Blazers really going nowhere. What up, Caleb? Dude, I I I used to follow D Wade because I, I watch college basketball. So you know, I remember watching him in, in Marquette. And even then, I was like, man, this guy's a beast. He, he just reminded me of, of Allen Iverson and just in a bigger frame. The way he just relentlessly attacked the basket time after time after time. And then when he came to the Heat, I was honestly, I was honestly surprised he got to us at the, you know, with the fifth pick in 2003. And from then on, it was just love at first sight, man. You know, I, I would argue that coming out of college, D Wade was probably the best player available, LeBron included. It is, it is a love story. Me and D Wade sit in a tree. K I S S I N G. All right, let's keep it moving with this illusions football. D D Westbrook with a jumbo patch for the Jaguars. Fucking Darko Milicic, bro. What a joke. Zay Jones, four color patch for the Bills. That's pretty cool. Darko Milicic, wow. From it might be it, Mar, it might be Marco Fultz from now on. I don't know. Have you guys seen that guy shoot the ball? That thing is ridiculous. Tariq Cohen of the Bears to fifty. That's a good card. Got that. Chad Kelly of the Broncos to 100. Let's 
stuff in here. As always, he's like in every case. Jeremy McNichols with the RPA for the Bucks. Alright, we're halfway done. Let's keep it moving. I see the Colts gone in Vertex Football. Vertex Football now down to eight spots. Let's fill that up, peeps. If I was to do a filler for the rest of the eight spots, straight up filler would be $50 a spot. In a inner case of Vertex Football, we got the Bengals, Bucks, Cardinals, Jags, Packers, Panthers, the Rams, and the Redskins still available. So, uh, so let's get it. Let's get that vertex number one filled in the store, guys. I got high tech baseball coming up right after this for eBay. I got 18 spots left in a limited football full caser on my website, ripcitycards.com. 22 teams left in status basketball. Uh, last case of that that we have. Got 21 teams left in a full case, in a full jumbo case of top series one baseball. And Vertex Football down to eight spots. Inner case break. Let's get that thing filled already, guys. Eight teams left. I got Bengals, Bucks, Cardinals, Jaguars, Packers, Panthers, Rams, and the Redskins available. And if you've never made a purchase on the website, you can save 15 bucks. All you got to do is register. And you get that code emailed to you. Joe Williams of the Niners with an RPA. This is going to have to get randomed. So there. Marcus Mariota of the Titans. So you guys doing it like any crazy? I know some of you guys are going to be partying. I hope nobody's, you know, going the rookie route and going to a bar to go watch the Super Bowl. You got to have a little Super Bowl party. Got to. Got to. Chad Hansen to Wahana. For the Jets. Even if you don't like football, it's like a national holiday. You just fire up the grill and uh, get hammered. Uh, Doug Williams of the Redskins to Fitty. Well, Pappy, is there any way I can uh, convince you to get into, uh, into the Vertex? Oh, I want to get that field. I got nine, eight teams left on that. What are you doing, Ra Ra? We got our Darius Stewart to fifty. Uh, yeah, with a with a patch. You know, at this point, I think the Patriots are gonna win, honestly. You know, they got the referees on their side. You know, there's there's just way too much going against the Eagles. Uh, I regret to inform. I always give good deals for at you. Come on now. Come on now. Your brother's hosting. Oh shit! So what are you? Are you bringing like a cake to that thing? What are you? What are you doing? Don't don't tell me you're bringing the the bean casserole. <laughs> or, or or are you bringing the potato salad? The crucial potato salad. Listen, I'm not. I've, I've learned to not root against the Patriots, but I'm still going to continue to do so, especially in the Super Bowl.
Well, Pappy, like I said, man, I got the Bengals, Bucks, Cardinals, Jaguars, Packers, Panthers, Rams, and Redskins available in Vertex number one. So out of those teams in Vertex football, if there's anything you like, let me know. Oh, listen, I'm not predicting anything. I just want to see a competitive game. Even if it's a repeat of what happened last year, the Eagles have a big-ass lead going into the fourth quarter, and then they, they fall apart to another comeback from Brady. That's good. That's a good That's good television. Fuck it. Honestly, at this, I just want to see history being made. Either way, something cool is going to happen. Patriots winning their sixth Super Bowl in like 10 years. Like, how long has it been? Like 18 years since Brady's been their quarterback? Or the Eagles winning their first Super Bowl since like the 70s or something. So either way, greatness is happening. So as a football fan, you know, it's going to be it's gonna be fun. Our Darius Stewart, RPA there for the Jets. Uh, but I'll, I'll be completely honest, I do not want the Patriots to win. Y'all know this. But it would not surprise me in the slightest if they actually did win. Alright. Oh, the, the game's always won by coaching. To 25, this is going to have to get random. Deshaun Watson and Tom Brady. Dual relic action. What time is the game again? The Super Bowl? So I can uh, know, know when exactly. To, I want to be shit-faced by the time the game actually starts. Noah Brown at 150 for the Cowboys. You know, that way I can not really care. <laughs> Ooh, sweetness for the Panthers right here. Numbered 17 out of 20. Dual auto for Christian McCaffrey and Curtis Samuel of the Panthers. Uh, JD, are you talking... You, you, what, what is that? For the... For Vertex? Let's see, Bucks, Rams, and the Cards. Yeah, that I'm assuming that's Vertex. Let me see what I can do for you, JD. What to do, Chris? I got you, JD. I'm putting something together right now for you. Uh, let's see. It'll cost one seventeen. Let's call it from 117 to 105. What do you say? From 117 to 105, a $12 discount. I guess new guy discount if you want. If you want. So 105 for those three teams, JD. Let me know, and I'll take your teams out. You know, what What worries me, though, is the fact that Eli Manning is not quarterbacking the other team. If Eli Manning was the quarterback for the Eagles, forget about it. Championship. Eagles have never won a Super Bowl? I thought the, I thought they won one way back in the day with, like, Randall Cunningham or something. So, J.D., like I said, uh, Bucks, Rams, Cardinals for 105. If you're down, let me know. I'll take your teams out. Man, talk about pressure. They And they never will win a championship? Ouch. Oh, the Eagles won in the Tecmo Bowl. Ah, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Bo was hurt that game. They don't deserve a championship? Well, who are you to, to decide who wins and who deserves a championship or not? What the hell?
Oh, damn it. That's wrong. Uh, Chase, yes. I'm assuming yes to uh, take the teams out. I think you're, you're behind on the stream. Maybe that's why you're kind of back. Kind of, kind of behind there. Throwing batteries at players. They're just, they're passionate people, man. They're passionate people. All right, let me take those teams out the store for you, JD. Ah, Shannon coming out of left field. What's up, Shannon? How are you? All right, so the Bucks, Cardinals, and the Rams coming off the board. Oh, you're thinking about it. All right, never mind. All right, so putting that back in. Rams, the Colts, and the Bucks. All right, there we go. Got that done. Anyway, let's finish this up. Listen, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. If you guys think Philly fans are, are bad, you guys have never seen a soccer game, huh? Watch a soccer game from, like, overseas or South America. <laughs> Jack Boyle of the Colts to 150. I mean, listen, if you get, a, if you get like, 50, 60,000 drunk people that are angry, something's bound to happen. Especially in the city of brotherly love. Aaron Donald of the Rams to 150 with an auto. Nothing there. David Johnson of the Cardinals to 100. The patch. Shorter, I don't know what I said. I, I just... uh. Talking mad shit as usual. To 100 RPA of the Rams, Cooper Cub. Nice one. Whoa, things just got really dark, Jeremy. Holy shit. I hope that does not happen. Wow. Things got really dark. <laughs> Uh, to 100, J Jordan Howard Bears, Todd Gurley Rams, and J.J. Dolphins. That has to get randomed. Yo, I heard about that, Schroeder. I heard that they, they grease the, the light poles or whatever so that people don't climb them, and they still do it. <laughs> Looters should be shot. Damn, Jeremy, remind me to uh, never, never steal a pop tart from you or something. Shit. What up, Shannon? Finally shouting me out. I was waiting for it. <laughs> Let me check the store here. Well, no, I didn't say I didn't say anything about looters. I didn't say nothing about that. I didn't say nothing about that. If someone looted our shop, I think we have insurance for that, right? I'm pretty sure uh, businesses have insurance for stuff like that. Riot insurance. <laughs> Hi, yes. Uh, I would like to uh, report damages. Yeah, see, some some asshole Eagles fan just burned my business down. Yeah, we're located in Philly. Oh, sweet. You're going to give me a bailout? Oh, awesome. Cool. I'll take it. Yeah, sure. Thank you. No, nah, don't worry about building the business again. I, I wanted to retire anyway.
Man, Sixers are destroying the Heat right now. All right, last box, Mojo. I need a one on one, or we, or everyone in here is gonna start looting. Andrew Luck to 100, 100 out of 100 for the Colts. Probably will never see this guy again play. At least I don't, I don't know, man. That's kind of a scary situation out there. Fly Eagles, fly! Four color patch to fifty. Mac Hollins. There you go. What else? Nada. Amara Darbo, the Seahawks, with an RPA. Boom. That will random. Fucking Panini points. I don't like Panini points. Don't like Panini points. All right, high tech baseball coming up right after this is done, you guys. So we have Jake Butt to 150 for them Broncos. Man, Sixers up by 14. Absolute domination. That Ben Simmons character is a fucking cheat code. A seven foot point guard. That shit ain't even fair. That's some 2K shit. Alright. We got some randoms to do. I'm going to do the simplest random first. Uh, it's these matching number cards. It's either going to go to the left or right side team. So let's roll the die. If I get an odd number, it goes to the left team. Even number, right team. Odd left, even right. Good luck. Got the number seven. That's an odd number. So it's going to go to the left side teams. So Broncos, Giants, Jets, Seahawks, Steelers, Chiefs, Titans. And this one is uh, the Niners. What up, Matt? Did I miss, did I miss something? No, I didn't. Oh, you mean these box toppers? Yes, I did forget about these. Not really, though. I just wanted to get that matching number thing out the way. Got some randoms here. I got it, Jeremy. I got this dog. I got this dog. Come on, man. Drew Brees of the Saints to one hundo. Matt Forte to fifty for the Jets. Jason Pierre Paul to one hundo for the Giants. Is it cheating to pull a chair out? And you're playing uh, musical chairs. Ah, oh, fuck that guy. I'm not even going to bother saying his name. LaShawn McCoy to Juan Hanna for the Bills. Frank Gore to 100 for the Colts. Uh, Pappy... Uh, have them send me an email and I'll get it done. Jason went in a 50 for the Cowboys. And Leonard Floyd to 100 for the Bears. So those are that. That's done there. Uh... Let's do the random now. We're going to go... Uh, I don't know how many times we're going to go. i got to roll die for that. We're going to go five times in the random. For 400 Panini points. Oh, God. 
Yay. Good luck. That's one. We're going five times. And the money shot. Oh, splooging all over the Chargers. There you go, Chargers. Don't get too excited. 400 Panini points going to you. Oh, yeah. Uh, still not done with the randoms. Uh, let's do this now. So we have the Bears. What an idiot. What a fucking idiot. I ain't even... I ain't even show it. What a jackass. All right. So, Chargers, I am so sorry. I did not show the randomizer. So, that is my bad. So, let's redo that again. So, 400 Panini points is going to somebody. Got the teams here. Five times. One. Two. Two. Three, four, and five. It's going to the Cardinals. Sorry for that tease, Chargers. That is uh, completely my bad. But as you can see in the video, I did not show the randomizer. And I did this time around. Sorry, sorry for uh, jerking you around, Chargers. 400 Panini points going to the Cardinals. All right, so now let's random this triple relic here. We got Bears, Rams, and Dolphins. Bears, Rams, uh, Dolphins. So for these, I'm just going to roll die too. All right, we're going to go six times in the randoms now. Top team in the list gets this triple relic. Good luck. Two, three, four, five. Money shot. Goes to the Bears. There you go, Bears. Oh, my God, he's writing on the cards. Relax. There you go, Bears. Uh, well, the rest of these, I'm not going to do the randomizer on this. These will be simple. It's either going to go to the left team or the right team. Odd number left, even number right. Ooh, so it's going to go to the odd numbers. So it goes to the left side team. So this one is Texans. You know what? I'll roll a die for this one too. Left to right side team. Odd left, even right. Got to roll another die for that. That was weird. Number six. Uh, I could grizzle bees, but, I mean, it's it's super shady, and, and that's not good. So it's going to the right side team, even number. So this goes to Chargers. There you go. Chargers redeeming themselves. That's good. That's easy. See, Mojo comes around. And now let's random this bad boy. Roll die again. Even number left team, odd number. I'm sorry. Odd number left team, even number right. Odd left, even right. Odd left, even right. Going to the left side team. So this goes to the Texans. Oh my god, he's writing all over my cards. So what? Fight me. There you go, Texans. Recap time. Oh yes. So exciting. So we have uh, Sidney Jones, Eagles, Jake Butt, Broncos, Amara Darbo, Seahawks, Cooper Cup, Rams, Aaron Donald, Rams, Jake Doyle, Colts, Christian McCaffrey, and Curtis Samuel, dual autos for the Panthers, Noah Brown, Cowboys, or Darius Stewart, Jets, Doug Williams, Redskins, Chad Hansen Jets, Joe Williams Niners, Jeremy McNichols Bucks, Chad Kelly with that sweet beer belly for the Broncos, Tariq Cohen Bears, Malik McDowell Seahawks, Donnell Pomfrey Eagles, Kenny G RPA for the Lions, Devontae Mays Packers, 
Dante Foreman Texans RPA, TJ Watt Steelers, Jake Doyle Colts, and a Deshaun Watson for the Texans. Nice. And that was the break, you guys. 2017 Illusions Football, inner case number 19, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get that right out to you.